Um, as we all know, it's been a special year for this company. Um, and as we all know, this company started as Spirit Studio. Um, and if you wander around Spirit Studio upstairs, you'll see lots of references to the Stone, stone Roses. And the history of Spirit Studio was intrinsically linked to the history of the Stone Roses, who, of course, this year celebrated their 20 years. Um, but it's more than that. It's more than just a professional commercial link. Um, there's a very strong sort of personal link in that my brother, who started Spirit Studio, um, his favourite band was Stone Roses. And they remain uh, very dear to his heart. Um, and when he's uh, had a couple of glasses of red wine, he rings me late at night. I can hear it in the background. And um, he was really pleased that we were having Manny over. And he asked that we play this. So, over to you, Matt. Okay. What do you remember? I remember that session for a start. That was the Phil's Goal sessions at Sawmills in uh, Cornwall. For us, music, it was vital that we, we did it because there was nothing else for us to do in Manchester. And your brother, God bless him, was one of the first people who saw something in us and bent over backwards to bloody make sure we could get cheap or even free studio time so we could indulge ourselves and uh, work on it so if you ever get to meet the the, uh, the great Johnny Brakel buy him a pint man because he, des he deserves it